In 1929, a comic strip called Thimble Theater featured a damsel in distress named Olive Oil and a nervous sailor named Wimpy. He was initially introduced as a rough and tough sailor who arrives in the fictional town of Sweet Haven. The storyline at the time focused primarily on Olive Oil and her brother Castor Oil. Pope was hired by Castor to crew a ship for an adventure to Dice Island to seek the legendary Whiffle Hen. However, Pope's role quickly expanded due to his popularity among readers. Sigur saw the potential in Pope's character and gradually shifted the focus of the comic strip to revolve more around him. Pope's distinctive traits, including his one-eyed squint, bulging forearms, anchor tattoos, raspy voice, and penchant for spinach, endeared him to audiences. Pope wasn't the star at first, but people loved his spunk and his trusty pipe. He quickly became so popular that he got his own cartoons in the 1930s. One of the defining characteristics of Pope is his incredible strength, which he gains from eating spinach. In the cartoons and comic strips, whenever Pope found himself in a tight spot or facing a formidable opponent, he would reach for a can of spinach, consume it in one gulp, and instantly become unbeatable. These cartoons were filled with slapstick humor, catchy songs, and of course, Popeye's amazing strength after gulping down a can of spinach. He'd always use his newfound power to defeat the villain, usually the grumpy Bluto, and win over his love, olive oil. Pope's adventures weren't just funny. They taught us that even the smallest person can be a hero with a little courage and maybe a can of spinach. He became a cartoon superstar, and even today, kids all over the world still enjoy his stories. So next time you see Popeye, remember, he's not just a sailor who loves spinach. He's a symbol of strength, kindness, and the power of believing in yourself no matter your size.